Selena Gomez opened up about her mental health struggles in more detail than ever before as part of her new Rolling Stone cover story. The singer confirmed that she had entered four different treatment facilities since her early 20s. She also spent a few years contemplating suicide, although she never attempted to end her life. I am going to be very open with everybody about this. I have been to four treatment centers, Gomez said. I think when I started hitting my early 20s is when it started to get really dark, when I started to feel like I was not in control of what I was feeling, whether that was really great or really bad, she said. Gomez added about contemplating suicide, I thought the world would be better if I was not there. Gomez battled psychosis in 2018 and when she finally walked out of it, she was diagnosed with bipolar disorder. Doctors immediately loaded her up with various medications but she said they also had a negative effect on her. It was just that I was gone, there was no part of me that was there anymore, she said. Eventually, Gomez met a psychiatrist who told her that many of the medications she was taking were actually not needed. With the psychiatrist's help, Gomez began to detox off certain medications and felt herself coming back to a more stable place. She also touched on all the fans' third drama where fans accused Hailey Bieber of stealing her ex, Justin Bieber, saying it made her feel bad about herself. In the past, she says this kind of incident could have set her back for months, but this time it was diffused with kindness. Selena Gomez gives a deeper look into her life in her new documentary Selena Gomez My Mind and Me. The documentary is out on Apple TV+.